Hi everyone, my name is Lachlan Johnson. I'm a sports scientist here at the Queensland Academy of Sport. Today we're going to be doing some of our standard uh, rowing physiology testing, but with a bit of a difference. Today we're going to be measuring pretty much everything. Uh, so let me show you around, around the lab and I'll show you what we're going to be doing with our rowers today. So what we've got here is our instrumented rowing erg. It's pretty much like a standard uh, concept to rowing ergometer, um, but one of our sports scientists here, Mark Andrews, has instrumented the erg so we can measure pretty much everything. So you can see in the handle, you can see this cord attached to the handle, so that, what that's doing is measuring the amount of force our rowers are applying to the handle when they pull. Underneath the foot stretcher here is force plates. So that's measuring how much force the athletes are producing with their feet, and we can measure any imbalances between the left and right foot as well. On the seat, you can see what looks like a piece of string attached to the end of the seat. So what that's measuring is how fast the seat is moving and whereabouts the seat is um, in relation to the handle. And also on the handle, we've got the same thing, measuring how fast the handle is moving and where the handle is in relation to the rower. So also, while the rowers are doing this testing, they'll be wearing this headpiece, which measures their rate of oxygen consumption. During this test, we'll be able to get an idea of the rower's VO2 max, which is a critical factor um, for being successful in rowing. So this here is our metabolic cart, and what that's doing is that's going to measure um, from the headpiece which the rowers are wearing, the air comes through into um, the metabolic cart here, and that measures um, the concentrations of oxygen and carbon dioxide um, in the air which the rowers are exhaling. At the end of each uh, piece they do during their testing, we'll get blood lactate samples um, to get an idea of how hard they're working. So this here is our Vicon 3D motion analysis system. So what uh, these machines are doing is they're picking up the balls that we've got placed on parts of the rowing ergometer. So they give us an idea of where each part of the erg is in relation to the rower while they're rowing. So what these cameras are doing is they're picking up the ball we've got here on the side on the seat, the balls we've got on the foot plates, and also on the handle. So that gives us a pretty cool 3D picture of, of how the rowers are doing their erg. And from that, we can pick up little uh, parts of their technique which we might be able to adjust in order to help them to perform better on the erg. What we've got is mission control. So these are the three computers, and these are our sports scientists, Mark Andrews and Josh Carrius, and they pretty much pull the whole operation together. So they've been able to um, build software which is able to measure everything which I've showed you today. Um, from the instrumented erg to the Vicon, they're able to pull it all together, and from that we can take the information, take it back to the coaches, and find some ways in which we can help make our rowers better.